with today what we're doing here on a day-to-day -day basis. It's certainly a challenge when you live every day in you know, this relatively complex scientific world and then you try to explain it to a 10-year-old. My name is Hendrik. I am 27 years old. I'm a PhD student here at the University of Calgary and I have been involved as one of the instructors for the Mini University this summer, I'm showing some of the kids what we're doing here in the lab day to day, especially what we're doing with our emotion analysis system. Um, it's actually quite interesting. I'm, I'm very surprised how much they actually know already coming in. And that's why we can make video games? That's excellent. That's totally correct. I always found in school that was kind of lacking, that somebody explained to me what can I do with all these skills that I'm learning. So I find that really nice to explain that to, to younger children and, and maybe actually motivate them to you know, pursue a degree in the sciences. Exactly. This summer we introduced this new concept where we try to bring uh, students that are naturally here at the university for these kinder camps uh, to, the, to the faculty and to the laboratory because we wanted to introduce them uh, to some research that we are doing here. I think the idea is not so much about getting them excited about science, I think the idea is more to show them at a very early age that the university is an open place, there's fun things going on here, there's good research going on, and if explained in an appropriate way, anybody and everybody, independent of age and independent of what your background is, uh, can understand it and should be able to understand it. And I thought this was a, was a very good idea, not only for exposing younger children to what we're doing here, but I thought it would also be a challenge for our students, for our graduate students and trainees who talk to the students and show them what they're doing, that it would also be a challenge for them to bring it to a level uh, where children would be understanding fairly complex issues in research that they are doing. I think it's really an important skill for scientists that you can convey a message in a simple way to somebody that's not a scientist. But I was blown away by how much they already know. I always joke with them that I had to come to university to learn these things and they seem to know that already so uh, I think the future is definitely looking good.